Hey, this is Holier Than You One. Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. Looking at stuff, obviously, she's shopping. She, she's a girl, shopping, right? Big thing. <laughs> Zidane. Sound great. Good. Mm hmm. She's a character with a Western accent in the game. Oddly enough, really, there's no one else with that kind of accent. That bugs me. Is he here? She better go back to the end. That would bug me. <clears throat> yeah! Crossing the border seems like it'll be quite easy, you know? You'll see why, eventually. So, let's see what else we can find around the village. You can look in here, Dagger just says something about about how she should be speaking. Uh, what's over here? We can't get to that chest. We can look out here. Huh. Uh, I don't think we'll ever know, and you can use that little path to the side there to leave the village if you want. We don't need to, though. No reason to. <laughs> what is this face? Does he even have a face? <laughs> wow. <laughs> this game is so ridiculous. <laughs> And this is just the start of the game, viewers. This is just the start of the game. All the ladies in the world. Right. <sighs> this is the silliest game I've ever played. But on, on the plus side, you know, tactics advanced is starting to wrap up. But there are chocobos in this game, so that's more important. I'm actually test running Spyro 3 Year of the Dragon because I couldn't get the other two to work. Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm having too much fun with it. I almost forgot to do, my, do any recording today. <laughs> what the? Did he just get grabbed? Cat's Eye 2, sir. Just watch that. And go do stuff. This is, like, so peaceful. Pick one up. Dude. Does that have anything to do with Vivi? Something for this new game? I think we were supposed to get a letter for him from Moist in the Fire Cavern. Oh well. It just says something about that Moogle Stiltskin, after he was frozen, he was Stiltskin walked right by him. Where are the adults? Come 
And that farm is unusually small. Maybe they're a village of monsters. A good plan. Dan is one smart dude when it comes to making a plan. <clears throat> I love the music. I really do. Let's play too. God damn it. <sighs> Tell him what? Hey, weren't we at that mountain? Yeah, Mora, didn't he want the. the coffee? I, I find myself saying nay quite a bit in, in real life, viewers. Nay sounds so much better than no. Story time? We should go look for him. I mean, when somebody's late, the best course of action is to find them, isn't it? Now let's equip everybody up. Yeah, just hit the optimize button. Oh, what? We can add status already? That is a great ability for Zidane, whose weapons can do have good statuses in some cases. We'll be getting a great weapon event later on in the game that adds status is useful. Vivi was over there, wasn't it? And Bright Eyes has an ability to protect against chocobos. No, not against chocobos, but um, against blindness. Good, since Zidane only has mail. Snip, 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 snip. Dog must be looking around for food. Or for rabbits. It's not duck season anymore, viewers. Huh? Huh. Into the underground. Maybe the, the well? Ah! Get off me! You weird little kids. Huh, we, we can't get in through the well. Oh, well, let's check in the windmill. We never looked upstairs, did we? There are two chests. Windmill's turning so we can't get near them. Is it? It's a hidden treasure. No, passage thing. What's down here? Oh, wow. Pretty nice looking place they got. But what's down here? And why are all the adults gone during the day here at Dolly Village? Find out next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. I'm holier than you want. Have a good day, and I'll see you all later.